Ah, it's time to check the demo of Signal is uh, a survivor horror pixel art game with uh, many influence from the works of uh, Tsutomu Nihei from what I have seen. Uh, let's see here. Oh, we start with the settings. Display. Mm, let's add some brightness. Hmm, auto load off, quick taser, tech speed, nice, audio, hmm, radio volume, also this is a controller game, let me grab my gamepad, hmm, okay, done, system calibrated, some people may experience discomfort, yeah, yeah, keep that in mind if you have uh, any Issues with the flashing lights, some parts of this game. But well, did he manage to read that? Okay, we start the uh, whole mysterious here. Signal is press any key. Okay. Yeah, Blame is uh, from Chutomonihe Dio. Blame, uh, Abara, Bayon. Biome uh, oh fuck I forgot the, the other title anyway Knights of Cydonia and other dark uh, grim uh, sci-fi titles I like uh, how the eye follows this thing now let's see wake up oh yeah even the character looks like uh, one of his characters I like the design. Oh. Huh. Is our character a cyborg? Probably. Oh, here is my inventory. Oh, I like the the sound design. Really old school uh, vibes. Can we exit this way? No. Okay, this is my fast movement. No entry. Okay, it looks from the other side. Ah! Uh, look at thing. Okay, let's go this way. LSTR Futures Repair Logic Module. Serving our great nation as ship technicians and brought the scout vessels of the Penrose program. LSTR type replicas like yourself are equipped with a specialized repair logic, allowing them to quickly and easily repair both themselves and important mission equipment. Accessing the RLM factions. Enter the inventory screen by pressing the inventory key. Select the item to repair with the left and right direction controls. Press the direction key to open the command menu. Select the combine option to enter combine mode. Oh, okay. While in combine mode, select a second item to repair by using the left and right directional controls. Press the action key again to combine both items. To repair damage to the replica body, select the suitable repair item and simply choose the use option in the command menu. Sometimes it can be helpful to take a good look at an object for all sides. Select the inspect option in the command menu to enter inspect mode. While in inspect mode, use the directional controls to rotate the, the item to look it from all sides. Okay, that's a cool way to give me some uh, tutorial there. Oh, nice. Now we're talking. Type 75 pistol. The Type 75 pistol is a short recoil operated locked bridge semi automatic pistol chamber in 10 
but 20 millimeter this reliable versatile handgun is the standard issue sidearm or ion protector controller stuff uh replica users remember to first equip the type pistol yeah deploy hold the aim to disengage the safety while the target mode the attack key and direct direction key will both fire the weapon uh-huh do not waste ammunition yeah we know this is a survival horror stuff for its resource for the nation when a target is down try to finish it off by kicking or hitting it with a baton to preserve ammunition okay Okay, adhesive tape, that's always useful. Oh, we can actually check this. Penrose Scout Vehicle Status Monitor. Critical system failure detected. Location unknown planetary surface. Crew status A Young. Gestalt pilot, no signal. LSTR SB uh, B12 replica unit active. Mesh hole. Oh, yeah, this is me, I guess. Hard landing on surfaces detect critical systems. Oh. Okay, I don't think I can interact with anything else here. Okay, this is my map. Okay, let's equip this thing. I'm going to go on the enemy right away. Let's go this way first. Oh fuck, there is another enemy. Ah, fuck you! Come on, stop! Oh, no, no, no! Bitch! Them. Oh, we fucked up. How can I reload? Ah, uh, well, the combat is a bit uh, quirky. It was bad. Pick up a repair spray. Yeah, we need that shit. Now, let's see. Aim. Tune radio. Oh, heavy radio. Fire weapon reload. Uh huh. Do I have any any other bullets here? Oh, we only have five, four bullets. Ah, damn! A single user bird gun to fill damage areas with polyethylene-based expanding foam restores a large amount of health over time. Oh, wait a minute. Diagnostics. Oh, here is my radio receiver. Oh, oh look at that. Diagnostics. Hypersensitive. What is that? Over. Fragmented, catatonic, yeah, danger. Oh shit. We move the main menu there. Okay. Now let's use this thing. Okay, now let's go. Reactor cell maintenance. All on board electronics on. Uh, Penrose type vessels are powered by the ship's primary power source, a five cell adjustable sealed autonomous thermal nuclear power plant. The power output of each fuel cell can be individually controlled by adjusting the position of the fuel rods in the liquid column. Raising a rod will increase the power output of the cell but also increase the temperature of the fuel cell. 
to protect the reactor from dangerous heat damage, the control system will only accept fuel load position configurations below a maximum average reactor temperature of 700K. In case of vessel collision or hard landing, fuel rods may become moved out of alignment. After landing, always check the fuel rod alignment in the reactor control computer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Come on, use this again. Uh, how can I? Hmm. Okay, here is the manual. Here we can go out. I want to align the cells. How can I choose them? Uh. Yeah, low output. Hmm, how can I align this thing so we can get an output and then uh, we don't. Nice. Finally. Because now we'll have power on more uh, places in the ship. Oh, pity that we don't have any melee weapon here. Let's go this way first. Oh, nice! So we're almost out of ammo there. Thank you. Repair pads. Yeah, give me that. Oh, look at that. Here we can store stuff. I have two inventory slots only. Hmm. Uh, let's get the tape there. Disposable stun rod. Oh, nice. Now we have a new <laughs> helper here. Electro impulse device. The EG2 stun rod is a single use, short range, disposable, non lethal solution for incapacitating non cooperative individuals. In KP. In ca <coughs> it can be equipped to the tool slot in the inventory screen. Once equipped, it will be shown on, th on the lower left on the inventory screen. Huh. The EG stun prod can be used with one hand while on the move and even while aiming another weapon. When it's equipped to use a stun prod, simply press the tool key when facing nearby enemy. Warning, high voltage the electric discharge may arc to individuals close to the target. Oh. Use with care. Do not deploy on elderly, pregnant or individuals with known heart disease. Unless absolutely necessary, dispose the stun prod probably after use. Huh. Smear diary entry. Wake up from cryo in empty mess hall. I was wondering, Elster looking out, flight like some lost in thought. Sometimes I feel he's home. Hmm. Anything else here? Now let me. Uh, what's the tool? Oh, I'll be. Okay. Let's go here. Oh. Another crew member here. Or 
we're supposed to do here. Hmm. Do we have any clue for this thing? Uh, so I hmm. Let's see here. Uh, let's go in this room again. What was that on the floor? Hmm. Cycle fifty-seven. Yeah, I'm not sure how we can open that uh, cryo. I think that's a cryopod. Another lock. Okay. Let's go this way. There is one more enemy here. Screw you! Oh. oh, look at that, we're on first person mode now. The suit has been removed from the case. Huh. There is an AVA suit in the case. Can we grab that? Hmm, airlock controls locked in a circuit card. Oh, so we can open the airlock and move out with this suit. Huh. Okay, I'll come back here later. Uh, what's on this side? Mm, okay. Some codes A, B, C, D, E. Hmm. Well, we took a screenshot there. Repair spray, grab that. Ammo, that. Unless those were uh, things for the radio, let's see here. Mm, Twenty-seven eighty. Let's see. Ah, uh, we cannot go on that. Uh, Actually, found the message. Can say be big one. Oh, this is the beacon of the ship because we were stuck on this planet. Yeah, I guess this is the SOS message uh, for the other spaceships.
Uh, any other thing here? Let's see. Oh. Wake up. Unless that was the message that uh, the cyborg uh, received and w woke up. Okay, so it repeats, uh, wake up. Hmm. What the hell is this thing? Okay, oh here we can see all the notes we've already already read. There is my diagnostics. I wonder if well, later on we can actually improve the body with uh, some implants or something. Huh. Okay, here's the pilot's cockpit. Uh, let's see, what is there? A faded photograph is stuck on the LBM controls. Pick up the photograph? Yep. The landing and docking assist monitor is of no use for me now. The port controls panel. There has been a critical system failure to the hard landing. The ship's control panel. Judging from the readout, there is no chance it will ever fly again. Can we interact with anything here? Guess not. Starboard controls panel. The controls aren't responding to any input. Probably an electrical failure. Hmm. Anything other useful hints here? The ship's control panel. It's a lost cause. Oh yeah. Uh, anything in this way? Come on, move your head faster, damn it. No. Oh, let's see the photograph we got. Photograph taken on a self developing field. Despite the damage, Ariane Neon can still be seen. Oh, 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 well, look, look. Oh, this is the code for the pod. Hmm. And yeah, look at that. The cryo. Huh. Okay. Let's go awaken uh, this lady. What the hell? Pressing this thing for inventory. Uh, small amount of health, big amount of health. Motherfucker. Those things actually. S Look at that, you can actually wake again. Fuck you. 
Oh, that's the tip, damn it. I thought I killed them. Let's uh, get here. Let's make sure. Come on. Yeah, okay. Here we go. Oh, let's open up now. Awake. Wakey, wakey. Is this the co pilot of the ship? Oh, she's missing. Two pieces of a key saved uh, in half lie inside the cryogenic pod. Pick up the airlock key. Yep. Oh, now we need the the duct tape. That's why I had it. Even on the uh, on the future, you always need some duct tape. Okay, here. Let me uh, let's store the photograph. Grab this thing. Okay. Go now inventory. Combine this thing with the card. Oh, nice. Now let's go on the airlock. Where was the airlock? Let's see. Oh, yeah, yeah. We have to go through that big guy. Yeah, yeah. Screw you. Okay, give me the shoot. So here we go. So we're going outside the, the planet. Oh, I guess the demo is over. That's a lot of white. Now oh, what? Can I actually move here? What the hell, really? Where are we? There's the uh, the radio here. Oh, that's the wake up signal, okay. Yeah, don't see anything. Ah, uh, give me a second here. Oh. Hmm. 
Hmm. Oh, look at that. There is CRT mode. <laughs> to make it even more blurry. Oh, let's see. Let me reduce the, the brightness a bit. Oh, look at that. There is something on the horizon. Are they moving here? What the hell is happening? Aha! Uh -huh. Oh, now I can see my... Oh, oh, oh! oh okay, now we're moving. Okay, I guess we're moving till we reach the signal. Oh, finally. Damn, that was bright. Oh, another ground base. There is a strange hole leading deep in the ground. There is a faint line glowing in the deep. Crawl into the hole? Yeah, fuck it. I like how we are changing perspectives at some points. And I like the atmosphere of this game. It's really strange and immersive. Oh, look at that. The hell? It's a rather normal room. Now, this is an escape room where you have to find a way out. Old Imperial serials. I'm pretty sure these are banned. Textbooks on radio operation. They, they look old and worn. Okay. Dark pictures of a coastline and an island. Are they photographs? The national flag. Yeah. Huh. A heavy safe box wrapped in chains. Uh, is that a closet or something? An old wooden wardrobe. Hmm. Oh, the king in yellow? Is that the book? An innocent looking tom is lying on the table. It feels like it's calling to me. Pick up the king in yellow, yeah. <laughs> Look at that. I was I was uh, right. Pick up the king in yellow. Oh my god. Oh. Something happened. Preparing to set message. The national flag of almost China, yeah, probably. Achtung! Are they programming me? Yeah, those are German. Great hole secretly are dig where earth's poor to suffice. And things have learned to walk that ought to crawl. I think so. Okay, the same. Remember, I promise. Wake up. Oh, and we 
got the fatal layer right near the end. Nice. Signal is Rosen's in there. Yuri Stern and Barbara Whitman. Oh, so this is a project by two people. That was pretty cool. Nice. So th that was the demo of uh, Signal is. Go wishlist if you like the game. That was a pretty nice uh, action adventure survivor horror game with a dark sci fi atmosphere. I really like the change of perspectives there and the. Uh, the pixel art gave it a really grim and dark atmosphere. And I'm curious to see how the story continues. Yeah, I bet the, this won't be a fun game. Uh, the story will be really dark and grim, that's for sure. But it seems really interesting. Yeah, I might have wishlist this one and uh, check it out when it's out. And as I said before, this seems to have some influences from uh, the work of uh, Chuto Munihei. At least for me, the character design, some... Uh, Ritsu type and the whole how he makes the uh, buildings like that stair we go we went down there yeah really reminds me of his uh, work nice that was a pretty decent short demo